What's happening and welcome to 60 Second Hasty Lesson with your boy Drew. We like to highlight as many black history heroes that pioneered the path for us. So today we're talking about Charles Henry Turner. Now he was born on February 3rd, 1867 in Cincinnati, Ohio. He did well in school and graduated valedictorian in 1886 from Gaines High School. Now he proceeded on to earn his bachelor's and master's from the University of Cincinnati in 1891 and 1892. Now from 1893 to 1905, he taught at Clark College, which is now known as Clark Atlanta University. And in 1907, he received his PhD in Zoo from you from Chicago University. Now he was one of, if not the first black to have a paper published in the prestigious Science Journal. Now in 1908, he accepted a teaching position at Sumner High School in St. Louis. Turner published over 70 articles during his career and several, several of them were done at Sumner, where he did so under remarkable circumstances. He had significantly less access to resources and facilities than several of his counterparts in his field, yet made many impactful discoveries while working with a variety of species requiring a mastery of different rearing techniques. Now, some of his major contributions include being the first to prove that insects have the capacity to hear and that they can learn by trial and error. He, he established that honeybees can see in color and recognize patterns, and also the development of techniques to measure the learning and other types of behavior. He was also a leader in the civil rights movement in St. Louis, suggesting that racism could be studied by using comparative psychology. He was also involved in the development of social services for blacks in the St. Louis area. Charles Henry Turner's work was an important part of history, and he made valuable contributions to science. He is remembered on the Clark University campus on the Tanner Turner building and has multiple schools named in his honor in the St. Louis area. There's also a children's book written by him by Emmy Ross titled Bug Watching with Charles Henry Turner.